Well, a new plan on Beacon Hill is looking to put cash into the pockets of taxpayers who are struggling these days, as you know, with rising costs. Yeah, and this will come in the form of a $250 or a $500 check. Boston 25 News reporter Kelly Sullivan is live at the State House this morning. And Kelly, these rebates would be in lieu of temporarily suspending the gas tax. Yeah, that's right. So state lawmakers have finally come to an agreement on how to help out taxpayers. So instead of suspending the state's 24 cent gas tax temporarily, they are going to uh, send checks to people who really need it the most. Now, as part of the $510 million relief package uh, that's estimated about uh, going to help 2 million people, $250 will be sent to taxpayers who file individually and made no more than $100,000 last year. $500 will be sent to taxpayers who filed jointly with an income capped at $150,000. A person must have made at least $38,000 last year to be eligible, and the rebates will be issued based on their 2021 income tax return. Our goal was always to put money into the pockets of the folks who, who are feeling the pinch every day. It doesn't get you anywhere. It's nothing. I don't turn down money from anybody. It's a complete gimmick to help politicians before an election. Now, the Massachusetts Fiscal Alliance believes these one-time payments won't do much and instead wanted to see a broader tax relief like temporarily suspending the gas tax. The state currently has a surplus of $3.6 billion. So the House and the Senate, they are working to get this relief package onto the governor's desk and signed by the end of the month because that would allow for these checks to be in the mail and in the mailboxes of taxpayers by September. Reporting live from the State House, Kelly Sullivan, Boston 25 News.